Hey, what is up guys? My name is David Lee and I'm Asian with Hat. Wanted to talk to you guys about the Persec Gear uh, Riggers belt that they have. Now this is actually retailing for 150 Canadian dollars, but when it translates to, uh, translate to the United States, American dollars, it is about $115 and that's before shipping. So I believe this is one of the cheapest belts you can get as a Riggers belt in North America uh, without having to uh, wait a long time for a belt. So. Uh, with that in mind, let's talk about uh, why you should buy it. Me and Barry have been talking about uh, doing a video with their belts because I think that there's been a big back order on like the Ronin Senshis and uh, some of the AD AWS belts or like the tier belts. And I personally am not a big fan of the tier belt because they're not as rigid. I think that this is by far one of the most rigid belts, of course, next to like the Ronin Senshi. Now the Ronin Senshi has a multitude of different applications. I don't really need a, a D-ring with a personal retention lanyard, uh, so I just wanted to, to delete that and just run it as how I'd like it. So I only run uh, an HSGI uh, pouch setup over here, so two pistol tacos over here, uh, two magazine pouches, and then I, I of course have an Eagle uh, dump pouch over here. And then on my uh, right side, I leave it blank but on the inner belt, I actually use a Glock 19 or Glock 17 with my 6354DO. I think this is a really good combination to use. And the reason why is because if I wanted to take off the, uh, the drop platform, it's not too hard to just take off. So with that in mind, compared to the uh, other people, some people like to actually rig it on here. Trying to rig it on here is a big pain and I'd still like to have that option of actually taking it off when I want to run it on something else. Now, when it comes to how it runs, it runs very similarly to like the most popular riggers belt right now, the Ronin Senshi or the Cry MRB, where you actually have an inner belt and then you have the Velcro. I actually prefer that they actually did an inner Velcro, which is uh, actually loop instead of hook because if you actually had hook on here actually tears up your clothes or tears up your pants or tears up your chair when you're driving and you have uh, this inner belt on. And so I think this is a better option to have than having to have hook on the outside for your inner belt. Now, uh, when it comes to stability, I think this is by far, just like the Ronin Senshi, one of the most uh, st stable setups without having to do padding. Uh, and the reason why I say that is because it's not gonna move at all. As you can see, not that much flexibility. Uh, on the belt and that comes down to the thickness of the main portion along with the molly webbing over here And that gives it all the rigidity now The reason why he does Cordura wrapping instead of having to do like Murdoch webbing is because the Murdoch webbing He has yet to find any uh, Multicam Murdoch webbing that would be uh, rigid enough to his uh, Specifications this is very much like one of my old setups that I had where there was a lot of padding It's very much like the HSGI sure grip, but the difference is that it's thin, it's low profile, and it doesn't give you a lot of bulk on your sides, on your hips, because no one wants to look thick. So Persec Gear actually has multiple uh, things you can do. You can actually customize your size, you can customize the style of what you want on your belt. I went with a multicam uh, wrapped belt and then um, multicam Murdoch wedding. And so you could actually get a uh, multicam wrapped uh, belt in multicam black or any other colors. It could be just pure coyote brown uh, without any wrapping and it will work fine for you. You can actually get just uh, coyote brown and actually have Murdoch webbing if you like that. So there's a multitude of colors that you can choose from their website. You're not just limited to like a specific color like multicam or black. You can actually have black on multicam black uh, webbing. Multi a multitude of things you can do. So guys, what do you think of the uh, Persec Gear Cordura wrapped belt? If you guys have any questions, please leave them in the comment section down below, and I'll try and get back to you guys as soon as possible. Uh, more or less, I really do like this belt, and I don't think I'll be having any issues in the future. I'll probably be trying to do some follow-ups with the belt uh, for Persec gear in the future. So guys, if you like the video, please do like it, and if you dislike it, well, it is what it is. Uh, be sure to subscribe to Asian With Hat, and this is David Lee, and I will see you guys in the next video.